Hi, I'm Dennis Moreland with Dennis Moreland Tack, and today we're here at Carroll Rose Ranch at Gainesville, Texas, and then we're visiting with Sam Rose. The NRCHA Director of Judges has shown a variety of horses from cutters to halters to reiners to rope horses, and we're going to talk about the Romal Range, how to hold them, what's legal, what isn't legal. Uh, this is something everybody that shows in Romals needs to know. Uh, the Romals have gained a lot of acceptance in the last few years. We've got rainers, we've got ranch riders, we've got uh, cow horse people also riding with Romals and ranchers that, that just like the feel of them. Sam? Well, you know, the Romal there's there's rules with it uh, the diagram in the NRCHA rule book shows that you have to have a closed hand and what I what I've seen and I think everybody has when they go around and they they open their hand with their rein and they get an undue advantage with a inside rein or an outside rein whichever way they're going that that rain should be held here and you should have some distance somewhere on the on the Romal part of it uh, there's 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 ways that you can look and see it's really hard to see it on a video that you have at the shows but when somebody is going in a right circle and they want that rain you see that bubble that comes up. Same way if they're going to the left. And guys, they'll do this and get this left rein up. Here's the bubble. That's called slipping a rein? That's called, a, that's a one point penalty called slipping a rein. There's ways that you can hold the reins. Uh, if, if you're having trouble wanting to get your finger in that rein, just run that rein down and get your whole thumb over the Romal, and nothing can get in the middle of it then. What about getting your your hand, your Romal hand too close to your right? Well, you know, there's variations of everything. Anytime you go and you pull with both hands here, that's, to, to me, that's two hands on the rein. You should have a break in this Romal in the attachment here. Thank you very much. Okay. We, we appreciate that. and. I'm sure that's lots of knowledge that needs to be passed on. Well, it's just something to make some of the people aware of. Yes. That's, that's what it's about. And everybody doesn't want to be penalty happy. I'm not one of those guys. Right. It has to be black or white if it's a penalty. Uh, but to give the exhibitors and contestants a little insight, when we're sitting up there watching, uh, and we're watching every move that rider makes with his horse, we see things like that. Yes, and where you're supposed the, to. Where the people on the back gate that tell everybody they had a great run and they mark a 68, you know, they're, they're, they're really not telling them the truth. And they're, they're not watching that close. They're not watching that close. They yeah. got a different look. You're getting paid to watch every move that horse makes and, and, and that rider and, makes. Exactly, that's, that's the whole process, yes sir. Thank you very much, Sam. Yes sir.